Pew's Economic Mobility Project's latest public opinion poll shows a mixed view of how Americans are feeling in the current economic climate. On the one hand, we see a dramatic increase in pessimism. Less than a third of Americans believe that their personal financial situation is excellent or good. Additionally, Americans are increasingly pessimistic about the economic security of their children. Less than half believe their kids will have a higher standard of living than they themselves now enjoy. At the same time, we see a lot of optimism. About 7 in 10 Americans believe that they have achieved or will achieve the American dream and that they're in control of their economic situations. Americans want a hand up, not a handout. They believe that hard work and ambition matter and that people are responsible for their own economic growth. But they also believe that government has a role to play. Americans believe a variety of policies would be helpful for enhancing economic mobility in the U.S. They support reducing the government's debt and deficit and also want investments made in elementary and high school education and in job growth within the United States. I think the key takeaway for policymakers then is that economic mobility is a unifying frame and a nonpartisan frame and that working on policies that enhance mobility is a key step for ensuring the American dream is alive for generations to come.